All right, we are live for the first time, and I'm trying to get used to wearing headphones because OBS does not like audio when you are playing through speakers, which is what I've done my entire life on YouTube here. Um, but anyway, obviously, we are going to be playing through Hogwarts Legacy, and I thought I'd give streaming a try. I've never done it on any platform, so that being said, if... Uh, the audio is a little funky. Uh, just let me know. I will try and adjust on the fly. But anyways, let's just jump right into this game. I do have to say before we start, um, I know there's like a lot of controversy surrounding this game right now. Um, I don't believe in hating anyone for any reason at all, for any kind of re race, religion, you know, gender identity, whatever. But... I've been waiting a long time to play this game and I'm going to play it. So, anyways, let's jump right into it and make us a new character. I did start the game and skipped all the beginning cutscenes so that I could um, just get like my audio set up and all that good stuff. But anyways, we got our welcome letter here. We are pleased to inform you that you have been accepted at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry as a fifth year student, which I don't even know that whole deal. I didn't know you could be like accepted like that anyway. Anyways. Professor Weasley, I just noticed that. So, uh, oh, we have to hit F to start the game. Okay. Anyway, character customization. I know some people spend like forever on this, but I'm usually pretty quick. I'm good with that. And that's actually fairly close to my hair color. Hairstyle. We'll go with something a little more, a little more messy. All right. Let's see. Do we want? Eh. Got freckles. I don't really have freckles. Let's. I don't want. They gave him the one mole right there. Uh no. Yeah, we'll just go with that. I can't even really... Oh, it takes a minute to load. We'll just go with that again. Anyways. What's the difference? That was quite something. Okay, that's a girl. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. The guy. We'll go with that one, and... Let's jump into this. Ah, it appears we are almost ready to depart. Oh my goodness, I just realized I gave my guy white eyebrows. Casting. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Wow. <laughs> well, I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so It takes a second to load, so I thought I was still on brown, but anyways. I appreciate you working with me all the time. Alright, who's this dude? Oh Eliasar! George! Glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. Gave quite the fright to some theater goers in the West End. It's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I... Best not speak here, Eleazar. Mm -hmm. Of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We have the guy looks funny. I can't believe I did that to, to him. To. Wonderful <laughs> idea. As long as you're oh my goodness. You doesn't mind me tagging along? Not at all, sir. <laughs> After you. It's gonna bother me the whole playthrough now. I've been to the castle. Surely what there's a way to like go in and like change your hairstyle somewhere. Uh, 
Ah, they even got the invisible horses. So, I think they're called Thestrals. So I, I, not a huge Harry Potter fan. I've read all the books, seen all the movies. I'm not, uh, like one of those obsessed fans who knows every bit of lore about in the Harry Potter universe, but I have read all the books, seen all movies, so uh, I know a lot of the stuff that's going to go on. We just fly through the sky. We get special treatment. Before you left for Scotland. <laughs> just barely. <laughs> and who is your traveling companion? A new student. New? Yes, sir. I'm starting school as a fifth year. How extraordinary. It is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Nor have I. Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term began. I guess that makes sense. It'd well, be kind of, if they like made us a first year and we had like no spell casting abilities, it'd be kind of like a little boring, teacher. I guess. He's also a remarkably That's all right. And gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the Ministry. <laughs> Have you seen this? I have. Opinions differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe uh. it is a significant threat. And it was your wife, Elias. What was that thing? Who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died. Wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I... Received this. It was the last thing she sent me, Eleazar. It came to me via her owl. Was it like a scroll or something? No correspondence. I can only assume that she had to get rid of it quickly to keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock. I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. What's that glow? I don't see a glow. Nah. Those eyebrows are just going to dr drive me crazy until I fix them. Merlin's beard. How did you wait? We did. Oh, that's a dragon. Hang on. One of the mean ones. <laughs> I just can't help but laugh at my guy. Uh, I can't believe I. Whoa. You can see him all of a sudden. I feel like my character is going to get made fun of at school for his eyebrows. The key. Give me your hand. It's a... Ah. The port key. Oh, a cute little squirrel thing. Are you alright? You're hurt. Perhaps a bit. Take this. It's Wigan Weld potion. That's Wigan Weld. What happened? Poor George. I can't believe he. What the hell got into that? Did so I die? Attacking a carriage midair? 
A typical dragon would never... Professor? That seems like something a dragon just would Sir, do. Where are we? I'm not sure. Like attack a carriage midair? Of course he would. He's a dragon. He's going to wait for you to land or something? I'm feeling better, sir. If you like to look around. All right, finally get control. Let's see what this is about. But stay close. We've no idea who created this port key. Or why. Ah. I also got a new computer a few days ago, so trying to get used to my new keyboard. Okay. Where the heck are we? How far did that port key take us? Farther from London than the carriage traveled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. Sir, those ruins. Do you the think- The port key was meant to lead us there. I do. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe that she and now George died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find a path, however yeah, it is a good it game be. so far. All right. Let's see what we got. Mind your step. Where do you suppose your wife got the port key that brought us here? A good question. Yeah, I've actually been waiting to play this for a few for days. I had some family stuff over the weekend, so I didn't want to like start ancient it magic. and then not be able to play it for like three yes. or four days. A powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. Hogwarts Castle was built by and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't mm -hmm. know where she came into possession of the port key. But I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah, there's the path down below. This way. Obviously, dude. Come on. But sir, why was your wife searching for evidence of lost Pretty magic? spry for an old guy. Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. Uh, is that ice? There's it's an ice wall, dude. Here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. Okay, Focus give me a wand. The center. Basic cast. Well, it's just like an attack? Excellent. Oh, I see. You gotta hold it. Whoa. That is a bit ah. than I'd expected. Oh no, why do I have to stop? Come on, I know they hid something somewhere here, right? about this way. I feel like they hit something. Like, why would this path be here? Aha! They hit a chest. What did we get? Just some gold? Okay. Better than nothing. We're close now. It's just ahead. All right, ominous looking Steady ruins. Uh-huh. 
Yeah. That's a bit extreme for that spell, I think. Almost there. Okay, what are we doing? Someone have built this here. I suspect I feel like something's privacy. gonna come out here. That portal led us here for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place. Mm, maybe the statue. Come on. Professor, this statue. This may have been his home. That enchanted crystallized stone again. But what could it be blocking? What's this? Professor Fig. What's this? How mirror, odd. mirror on the wall. Why would someone have conjured that enchanted stone here? And how is there a room behind it? What room? I don't see anything. There's that glow again, like the glow on the port key container. Investigate. What you gonna do? What in Merlin's name? Godric's heart. Where are we? I don't believe it. Wake the goblin. Wait. This the same goblin? It looks like he's the Hello. same goblin from like the I thought these guys were all like mean and stuff. He's so nice. Vault number 12, I presume. <clears throat> Precisely. The key. Mm -hmm. Your wife's port key. Oh, yes, of course. This way, then. Stay close. To you. This is way different. Uh, keep your hands inside the cart if you don't wish to lose them. <laughs> All right, time for a roller coaster ride. Oh, we actually get to look around. How many volts are there in Green Courts? Hundreds. In fact, you'll see quite a few on our way to vault number 12. As we speak, we're just beneath the main lobby. The vaults you see now are the newest. Are private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power, or both, could have arranged for such a service. You want to take a breath? A what? Hmm. Waterfall washes away all enchantments. 
It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. How deep are we going? Vault number 12 was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. It resides in the deepest part of the bank. I really didn't Seven, want anyone to find this place, did they? To go. Oh, this poor guy. Imagine that's your job, to stand in the bottom of a dark cave. Just... Vault number. Hours. Days, probably. They probably just leave this guy down here. <laughs> On your way. Now that guy seems more like a typical goblin. He's not too happy about us. Professor, hmm? the armband that guard was wearing was glowing. Like the glow you saw on the porky container? No, darker. I saw that same glow on the dragon's collar. Yeah, what was that? We were just wondering about that goblin back there. He watches over the oldest section of the bank. Rare anyone goes there anymore. All right, let's finally start and do something. This vault was accessed. A goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. In that time, no one has visited Vault 12 yet until today. Okay. What's inside? It better be something good. Vault 12. Thank you for your help. What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Well, unlike Harry so, Potter's vault, it's not full of gold. They're going to make us work, aren't they? Access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait. Best of luck. That's nice. <laughs> Professor, that was certainly unexpected. I mean, there's a door there. What Come on, think? we can see the outline. Let me go. There must be something here. Revelio, perhaps. Revelio? Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. Wait. Wait, what am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to just hold it? I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Oh, I think I get it. There we go. I should read it sometimes. R. Revelio. There, I saw something. Move a bit closer and try again. Path to Hogwarts, okay. Revelio. A door. Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to. I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the port key container. If what you can okay. see reveals the way forward. Then I dare say we are about to discover the secret Let me of this in. Vault. Lead the way. I hope we find a secret to this vault, or else we're just gonna sit here until we starve to death. Blue Moss. This is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. But to what end, I can't say. Stay close. 
There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of Gringotts. I got my trusty wand. So far, I like the story, though. It's pretty interesting. I see something up ahead. What is it? That glow again, but on the floor. Aha. Uh -huh. Lumos. What happened? When I what? moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the what? ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir. I'm fine. You seem to have caused the floor to change. That statue? What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Revelio. I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Wait. When you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm. Perhaps you should cast Lumos. Lumos. And let there be light. Lumos. Well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. Ooh. Oh no, it's not going to make us fight these, is it? That's what it looks like. We're going to have to fight something. Surely. Look out! Protego. This is pretty cool actually. I wish I could move while casting though. Oh, I'm supposed to protect. I was not reading. I should read more. Someone attack me. Alright. So we can protect. We can reveal, and we can Lumos. Stupefy. Whenever I hear that, I just think of that song by Disturbed. Professor, anyway. Professor Fig. Professor Mr. Fig. Where are you? This isn't good. Uh oh. Lumos. I'm supposed to be. I thought it was like How a cutscene. Ah, let's just follow What's the light. Happening? The wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. Ah, that's where they're leading me. That glow again. Protego! Oh, wait. Rebellio! I suppose I'm on my own this time. Lumos. I need to 
align these statues with their reflections? Okay, come on. Here we go. It seems I have no choice. I'm going to have to fight my way out of here. Looks like it. Uh oh. Protego. Easy. I got this. Hold Q during perk Tego to Okay. There's a lot of enemies here. I noticed the one by their name, so are we gonna like level up? Like RPG style? Oh, we can sprint. But the wisp only run so fast also. There we go. That looks like something. The mysterious. <laughs> Professor Fig? Professor Fig, where have you gone? Okay. What the heck is this? I'm guessing this is what the person put in that vault. Uh, there you are. How did you... What is this place? I don't know. But I found this floating above that basin. That is no mere basin. That is a pensive Ooh. for viewing memories. Pretty cool. I wonder. Follow my lead. Okay. All is in place. The port key is well hidden. Perhaps too well. I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow. It will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as I can. Your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes, and if we are correct, Charles, the witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge. Ah. The responsibility. The graphics are damn good in this game, though. We've done all that we can. I see. So we're going to have some trials, 
find out some dark secret magic something and then yes, I haven't figured out the last part yet. Astonishing. Can I see find some villain who wants that dark magic. Of an ancient magic to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed. But could never. Still can't get over my guy's eyebrows, man. Why? Died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We were it all looks rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. But sir, you shouldn't be in there. I was right. Ranrock. Okay, who's that? Who's in the newspaper? Precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here, and we can let bygones be bygones. Uh, sir, they have the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. Okay, so is this going to be the antagonist? This little red-eyed goblin? The vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you didn't have them. <laughs> I have no patience for traitors. Now, where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Hmm. Well, perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. Uh huh. One thing I remember they said: don't mess with goblins. Incredibly strong. Okay. But they said no, you're not supposed to be in this vault. That's our chance to escape. Let's get out of here. We do not want to be a part of this, guys. Not at all. I know way out. Come on. He's a dark goblin, that's why. <laughs> it can't Evil. be. Evil. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both, wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. Hogwarts, huh? So why couldn't we take the train like everyone else? Why did we get like a special carriage for us and everything? That's pretty cool though. What's with the house on the lake? Did I like never notice that? Or is that just like something that was in the past? Hogwarts Legacy. Okay. They were must have been really proud. They let that linger a little bit too long. Oh, good. 
we haven't missed the sorting ceremony. So I've been thinking about expert, which house to pick. That seems more and appropriate. Online. I need to study this locket. I read something I about like Ravenclaw has ministry. less quests. They need to know what I think this game is going to be one where I kind of do more collecting, more exploring. Between you and me, of course, sir. Thank you. So I've been trying to decide between basically Gryffindor, Slytherin. Phineas, Nigellus, Black. Oh my goodness. Prepare yourself and they're like pure blood. What is it called? Like the racist against half bloods and stuff. Black family. The sorting ceremonies. Whatever you would call it. Complications. Complications. It seems the goblin problems. Goblins. I've no time for rumors. No good. He's not. He's an asshole. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. Professor Everyone's looking at my eyebrows, I'm sure. Welcome. You're just in time. Have a seat. Sure, everyone's like, why is this older kid sitting here? Ah, yes. A bit older than the others, mm -hmm. aren't you? Thank you, you Captain Obvious. Preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. I'm looking forward to exploring Hogwarts and the world beyond the castle and grounds. Mm. Indeed. Much can be gleaned by having an adventurous spirit. But your So, do these questions determine what house I get? Or do well. I get to pick? Mm. I wonder. Certain sense of adventure. Mm. I detect something in you. A certain sense of... Mm. What is it? Ooh. Ambition. Is it ambition? I may seem single-minded, but it is important to go after what you want from life. Mm. Hmm. Interesting. You've recently learned that you possess a rare ability. I detect a growing sense of ambition. And Maybe I don't get to pick. I thought I'd just last pick, but I guess they're gonna make us answer questions. You belong in Slytherin. Oh, you can pick a different house. You know what? Let's just go with it. That's what we answered. That's what we're going with. You belong in Slytherin. All right. And one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. Enough. It's not as though I've banned flying altogether. So that was their way of getting around making like a Quidditch game, you mini game. They just said, oh, last year someone hurt themselves. It's banned this I'm year. Sure have plenty to do before classes begin to they hurt move. themselves all the time in the Harry Potter series. I said I'm sure Why? you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Qu 
quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet you. I'm... Professor Weasley, would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As Deputy Headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. It's quite uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. It may be a bit of a challenge, but one I'm sure you're up for. I can be quite resourceful. I suspected as much. This is the entrance to the Slytherin common room. In order to enter, one must simply speak the correct password. Aspiration. Very well. Aspiration. Dang, they got a cool door. Well done. Now, go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. So 47 minutes in and we've been in cutscenes for probably 35 to 40 minutes. <laughs> Looks like everyone's gone. Better head to the common room. Here we go. I think we might be through a lot of the entrance stuff, though. Let's. Pretty cool. You don't have to walk so slow, guy. Come on. Oh, by years, I see. Man. Maybe level one lock. I could break that open. Yeah. I suppose some introductions are in order. That is not helpful. All right. Can I help you? Oh, you're the new fifth year. I'm Sebastian Sallow. Welcome to Slytherin. Thank you. Not everyone has a ministry escort to school. He was a friend of Professor Figs who merely joined us for the ride. Still impressive. Dreadful way to go, poor fellow. Glad you and Fig are all right. It was dreadful, certainly, but quite an experience, nonetheless. Interesting perspective. How did you and Fig manage to escape? It's all still a bit of a blur, to be honest. Didn't mean to press. You just get yourself settled. We can talk more later. What book were you reading? A spell book I picked up. Has a few interesting things, but not exactly what I was looking for. I'm sure you'll find out soon enough, but not every spell you may need can be found in our assigned textbooks. Hmm. You mean them? Are you saying some spells aren't taught at Hogwarts? You know, Which the ones, ones that kill people, enslave them, torture them. Spirits. Those kind. <laughs> that is a conversation for another time. It was good meeting you. Good luck today. Oh, you won't teach me now? Okay, guess over here. Uh, you might want to think that again. I really hope you get to see, or at least hear one today. I, I think I heard one. Hmm. Doubt mermaids find us that interesting. Ah. Based on all the chatter when you entered the common room, I'm guessing you're the new fifth year. I'm Ominous. Ominous Gaunt. Nice to meet you, Ominous. Well, you certainly had a memorable arrival. Well, 
Well, if I'm going to make my mark here, I had to start right away. <laughs> You're definitely in the right house. Do let me know if I can be of any help as you navigate your first days here, though I doubt you'll need it. Did that student say he thought he heard a mermaid? <laughs> yes, but I've never heard of a mermaid showing up outside our common room window. It is fun to play along, though. Been known to keep some first years on the lookout for hours. Were you expecting to be sorted into Slytherin? Most certainly. My family on my father's side are direct descendants of Salazar Slytherin, one of the four founders of Hogwarts. Not something I'm especially proud of, mind you. He was obsessed with blood status, a pure blood maniac. Mm. Unfortunately, most of his descendants do not fall far from that tree. Thank you, Ominous. Very nice to meet you. Pleasure was all mine. Don't be a stranger. All right, and Imelda. Wizard chest. Fair, are you? Here, watch this. Don't say I didn't warn you. Checkmate. Told you. You should have listened to me. Ah, oh, I know who you are. You're the new Slytherin, the one who barged in with Professor Fig last night. Interesting tactic on your first day, taking all the attention away from the first years. I'm Amelda, by the way. Shame I wasn't with you and Fig. I could have lured that dragon away. My skills in a broom are legendary. Perhaps Professor Fig's friend would have survived if we'd had your help. Precisely. Perhaps one of these days I'll show you a thing or two about flying. I can yeah, teach you let's fly. Speaking of which, I'd like to get in some time on my broom before classes. Do you have a lot of time to fly during school? I make the time. There's nothing like swerving through the spires of the castle and around the Quidditch pitch to clear... Eh. Goodbye, Imelda. Nice that was interesting. You. Don't care about wizard chess. Is the new fifth year Slytherin in here? Professor Weasley's waiting for you just by the stairs. My family yep, that would be me. Lumos. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts. Absolutely. Let's learn day. some I'm magic. Right. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. I think this Make is like in the 1800s, the late 1800s. At at Hogwarts. Correct. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year. You'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the headmaster and the department of... Uh, I'm just going to go live in the human world and cheat all the regular muggles out of their money with my magic so that sounds way better than working for wizards uh what's this what is it it is a wizard's field guide it will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's mm. expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Thank you, Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. This way. Oh no, we gotta follow you around again. Or some by around. What's this? I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Using the guide will also train you to be alert to your surroundings. Mm-hmm. The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding law. Do keep up. How could I not keep up? Why don't 
you cast Revelio on that spot? Revelio. And see what details the field guide can provide. Shape shifting water demon, native to Ireland, Great Britain, which usually takes the form of a long maned horse. Ah, the Loch Ness monster, huh? Okay, so we have to do these to get XP. All right, then let's see field guide pages exploration. Back up there. Sorry, I clicked something over on the other screen. Da, 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 da. Okay, let's get back over here. All right. Collect field guide pages in Hogwarts. One out two. Blah, blah, blah. Rewards must be claimed from the challenges menu. Okay. What's this chest looking at me for? Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that. Inside and outside of the castle. Oh, come on. And here we are, quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive, our King's Cross Station, so to speak. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Can you tell me more about the Defense Against I the Dark Arts I know what it is. Class? I just want to see what she defense says. Defense Against the Dark Arts, as the name implies, focuses on how to defend oneself. Very a master handy. Of defense against the dark or we are lucky to have the ever gifted a cat okay what will i learn in charm exactly what you might expect i think you will enjoy professor ronan he's and hogs made Thank you professor weasley a lot to absorb on your first day and you have much happily your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you out judging by your adept use of revelio earlier i'd say professor he did, Professor. He My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. We did take a bit of a detour on the way here. 
ended up exploring some ruins, and I shouldn't say more. Exploring ruins? Well, I presume Professor Fig has his reasons for keeping the details to himself for now. Speak of the devil, Professor Fig. Your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfect. I wouldn't say I chose the oh, how? Path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very how did well. it get by that this Enough guy teacher, didn't go to Hogwarts to to and class it's class the first myself. year? Might I rely on you, Professor? Have like all this magic and can find all are. these kids from across the country and they <laughs> miss the one who has like super magic powers? Good luck today. Seems a little and ridiculous, but okay. Your field guide. It will be field guide, find pages, got it. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. All right. Oh, it's going to make me. It's good to see you, Professor. I just and wanted you. to explore a I bit. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you and Professor Weasley talking about exploring ruins? She caught me off guard. I didn't tell her anything else about our travels here. I will say, I think she suspects we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Mm. Understood, Professor. Good. So she's a tattletale. Now, I see. I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well trained. So go to class. Alice, you have go to class. Of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, I'm trying. I'm trying to learn so spells. Let me go. Not so subtle reproof from Professor Weasley. Why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guides map? Unfold it and have a look. Ooh, Levioso and Asio. That's the one we're going to go for first, but... The map is enchanted to help you find your way. Oh, that's the enchantment? I thought helpful. we were about to get another Thank spell. You. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead. What with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our Wait. mysterious locket. Olivander's and in... focus on your classes and pay Must attention. be like his more dad or something. On the magic you are He's in Hogsmeade though? He was in like Diagon Alley. Anyway, whatever. Welcome to Hogwarts, finally. Compass new item unlocked. Okay, what's this thing? Hello. Hello. I don't believe we've met. Oh, hello. I'm Lenora. Part of everyone thinks I'm utterly balmy. Samantha thinks I'm potty. But it's this pain. If I know Hogwarts, and I do, an empty frame doesn't. If I have the time, I may look. I've been racking my brains long enough. Do come and find me if you stumble on something illuminating that solves the mystery. Illuminating? Lumos. That spot must be a clue. I should look around in case it's nearby. So it's got like this person with a pot. Protego. 
Lumos. Person. Like a big pot. Um, where are we going? Not here. Oh, it's showing us. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Let's go down here. This looks like the location from the painting. What could be so special about it? Ah. So when we collect the field guy pages, we come in here. So we got that. Let's see. Gear. Oh, we get gear. Ooh. Dang. I mean, I knew we'd be like cosmetic, but it has like stats and stuff, it looks like. Well. Anyway. Talents. That's what we want. I want that page. That's a page of the field guy, right? Maybe I need something. I'm guessing I need Asio, actually. That's the one that makes things come to you. Oh, it's not going away. Did I not finish the quest? Let's see. Revelio. Oh, there's something here. Revelio. Well, what am I supposed to do with that? Okay. Maybe I need another... What would it be? Lumos, maybe? Lumos. Oh, okay. Here we go. Let's get you back to your frame, little moth. I see. Ha! I knew there was a connection. I should tell Lenora that I solved the puzzle of that empty frame. I mean, she probably just saw you solve it. Like, literally, she's standing right above you, looking down at you. Lenora, you did? I found the location depicted in the painting and the... Oh, you have a knack for solving riddles. Natty's good at that, too. Well, I'm glad someone figured it out. The moth. I should have seen that. Level two. Ooh. Did we get a talent point? I saw talents. I want to go. Maybe not. That's flu powder. I mean, there's probably a ton I could go do, but. What the heck? What? We got symbols all around it and symbols there. Roll. What am I doing? Whatever. We're not messing with that anymore. Let's go with uh, the main quest here. Learn some more spells.
is it? Let's see. Okay, it's being tracked. So that's, uh... Oh, wow. Let's roll. Ooh, what's that? They're like... That's... Okay. What about this? Level 2 lock. Ah. What about this over here? Oh, wait, where? Okay, anyway. Let's go learn a spell. We need to we need to get better at this. Here we go. Lavioso. Lavioso. Professor Hecket. Perhaps you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces in your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in Eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. To the wise, age matters. This doesn't seem little. anything like the Defense Today Against the Dark Arts class from the movies the and the books. The hands of dark wizards more times they always than like I just had to, to study. Levioso, Levioso, a levitation charm. Levioso, a surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No. One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity, especially in the heat of battle. Now, let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. Uh, okay, so here we go. Steady your wand. Easy, Levioso. Levioso. Now, let's try something a little larger. Oh, yeah. Teach me how to fight people. That's right. Let us begin with the basic cost. See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Remember, a surprised opponent. Now, well done. Oh, yeah. We're Very learning. Good. But the best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Duelist, take your marks. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, <laughs> I want a fair duel using only Levioso, basic cast, and Protego. You may begin. This should be easy. Let me also. This can't be your first duel. Let's just say I'm a quick learner. I do not call the nice students for this adept. Okay. Your opponents for signs to attack or defend yourself. Let me also. And he's. Okay. Dang, is she gonna let me kill him? <laughs> Not bad for a beginner. 
In the books and movies, one stupefy sends him flying across like the the room, and I hit him with like fifty. My white eyebrows. Oh I yeah. Put you on the spot, oh yeah. You rose to the challenge. So Thanks nice. To Thank you, Professor Hackett. Glad to have you. Ah, it's hard getting to used practice. to wearing headphones. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things. From Sound is much nicer. But I'm just so I'm just not students. used to wearing stuff on my they head. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. Anyway, a classroom duel is one thing. But battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. Understood, Professor. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. Easy. All right. That's enough spectacle for one day. Class is dismissed. Oh, I'm not much for dueling. I prefer to keep things friendly. Okay. Nice work. Wait, a chest. You dueled Sebastian. He's strong competition. Well done. Why is it showing a chest? I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? Felt more like I was dueling an expert. Didn't I expect am an expert. To be so deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't your first duel. Hmm. Should we tell him? Eh. I've dueled enough. Consider yourself lucky I held back. Huh. Fair enough. You owe me an honest duel when you aren't. You know. You might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. I am a perfect fit for that. Exclusive Let's go. and unsanctioned. Count me in. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going oh, to, yeah. to break the rules now. And me then. and this guy get along. Joining a secret Think Harry Potter club, broke the rules every single year. the restricted section of the library. You just have to be clever enough not to get caught. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck or actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. If Luke you're interested. Luke and Brattleby. Clock tower entrance. Until next time. That definitely sounds fun. We're going to do that, but... I think we should get Asia. You Oof. can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. It looks like it's just up here. Can we just like run up right here. Ooh, a statue. I'm just gonna guess. No, but I heard something. Ah, the ghost. That's... This game puts a smile on my face. Um, up more? Maybe? Well, damn, how high do we gotta go? All the way to the top, it looks like. We sometimes have to remind him to finish the lesson. Alright, let's learn our spells. Then we'll start looking at some of these side quests. Ring around once we have a few. Here. Behind you. There is an open seat here. Thank you. Hello. I like how the Gryffindor and Slytherin are so nice to each other where it's like... And all the Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <clears throat> Everyone is so like they hate each other in Shall the movies and books. <laughs> Welcome They're like, oh, you're a Slytherin. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work. But I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right, 
I like his outfit. Please open your textbooks to page 517. But before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the color change and growth charms? Anyone? Anyone? Hmm? Uh, 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 I am afraid it is too late to study now. Hmm. My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing obliviate on one another. <laughs> uh, hmm. mm -hmm. Do you even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? Hmm? If you let us use magic outside of school, they'd probably all use magic constantly. And take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are, and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. All right, let's see what's going on here again. Space, 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 space. Oop. Asio. Maybe I can grab some of these out of the uh, some of them floating pages. That is not bad. You are a swift That's learner. Only. Professor I see Ronan. a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. Oh, nigh. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Well, as you all seem to have the basics down, and it is an exceptionally lovely day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After me. I know it's open world, but I. Do your decisions in this game affect, like, the ending? Is there multiple endings in it? I have no idea. <sighs> I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree. Hmm? <laughs> we don't get to play so, Quidditch. What better than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? <laughs> okay. <sighs> So why don't we have our newest students start us off? Hmm? Eh? Okay. Very simply, cast Akio on one of the spheres Akio. and relinquish your charm. Very good. Don't lose. Now, uh, oh, think I of see. this like gobstones, if you will. But instead of throwing them, splendid. Oh, Stay I see. Off. Okay, it stopped. We got one of them. Very good. Points to Slytherin. But there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Oh, I did terrible, though. She's going to crush me. You'll be the blues just as before. And Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yes, sir. We have to wait one at a time. Game's turn. Oh my goodness. Happens to the best of us. It like came so fast that time. Wait a second, I have an idea. We're gonna play this like shuffleboard. We're gonna not exactly your typical lesson, is it? Not that I mind. Oh, I gave her fifty points. Very good. Here we go. Okay. 
she got 50. She, that, ah, I did terrible there. What the hell happened to me? So the only way I win, there is no way to win. I could tie it, possibly. Right here, I have an idea. Nope. He got 150, and I think I have just. Yeah. Eh. I do it again. I'm gonna do it again. A bit more interesting, shall we? Wait, do I, oh, I have to. I oh, my goodness. Interesting at this point. I'll say. Enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. This round settles it all. Be sharp. Oh, you weren't. There we go. Here we go. Three, two. You are not making this easy for me, are you? I didn't hit it quick enough. I suck at this game. I need to levitate that back onto the board. Mm-hmm. It's gonna go on the 50, isn't it? I've gotta pull it off then. The only way. Okay. That's not all bad. We're at zero zero. We we can do this. Let us do this. They do terrible. Oh no. I pulled too hard. There we go. After. Do not Akio. Start going easy on you now. Come on, come on, fifty, fifty. Excellent control ha. there. Beat him. We did it. Very good, both of you. Well done. Passes dismissed. Gather your things on the way out. Good game back there. I must admit, I think I underestimated you. Took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. That's good to hear. It's a lot to take in all at once. To put it lightly, I remember how I felt when I first arrived. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Before I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. This may seem an odd question, but is magic the same there as it is here? Mm, mostly, yes. But I did have to learn how to use a wand when I arrived here. Hardly anyone at Wagadu uses one. You can cast spells without a wand. Oh, yes. I find wandless magic to be much more instinctive. Not to mention quite convenient if one is without their wand. Mm. I must admit, however, that I am growing quite fond of using a wand. It seems very dramatic. All right, that's it's enough of that. About another wizarding school. Thank friendly you. conversation until next time of course you can use Akio in a words if you would if you're so inclined. you wanted to speak with me professor I did I trust your first charms less well an outdoor competition what charm is there in you did well managing to best as gifted a student 
Thank you, Professor. I... Miss Unai is always a fierce girl. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has... Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special... Okay, special assignment, got it. Let's see. Akio. So we got Akio, we got... Ooh. We got 20 HP. Hello there. You're the new student, aren't you? Yeah. Hello. You wanted to speak to me. Samantha Dale. I've been eager to meet you. You're the student everyone's been whispering about. Hope your oh. first day is going well. Good things, I you hope. Certainly seem to hold your own Hopefully they're not talking about my eyebrows. I've been fortunate. Beginner's luck. <laughs> my brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Well, better see to my charms homework. I'm afraid I can't. Okay, so what's this chest icon that always shows up in I bet we're and then the werewolves join the goblins goblin in the uprising. Werewolves, where were you? In the goblin so what are these? And by the, end of it, the minister for magic was Albert Boot. No, it wasn't. <gasps> oh, what fun! I won't say my goodbyes. I shall cheer for the no. voice. Says you're telling I'm lies. I'm telling lies, Peeves. It was Albert Boot. No, it wasn't. It was Basil Flack. Oh! How do I open the damn door? Was the minister of boo or the minister of flack? Stop it, peeves, you'll get us there in trouble. Any more? In trouble you will be, but you can't get peeves a smack. She says it's a boo, and he says it's a flack. Peeves, enough. You'll get us all detention. Oh, and you're both wrong anyway. It was Hephaestus Gore. It wasn't boots and it wasn't flack, but you're all in trouble with Professor Flack. So. <laughs> <laughs> Why is he so colorful for like a is he a ghost? Anyway. Oh, there's another one, I see. The unicorn. Zero three. So what do we need to do here? Let's see if we can figure this out. Let's think. Okay. So you got the unicorn. The only thing I see at all. What? So Anyway Here Okay, so I gotta get talents. I don't know anything about this. So we got four. So 
See, this makes no sense. So maybe what about this door? We must get a spell to unlock things. Let's just go up here. Why not? What's up? Oh, he disappeared. Oh, I bet you astrology is like up here, right? Revelio. Nothing. What's up here? There's gotta be something. There's got to be something. How well. nice to see you, my young friend. What's this? How tall is this place? <laughs> Come on. Life is so peaceful in Hamlet. Well, when Godwin is on the earth, it keeps going up. Okay, so this. What's this? Oh, we get some glasses. <gasps> Oh, we want to use Lumos. So we are looking for a telescope and a tower and a drawing board. up dude are there owls up here this tower is like so tall Ooh, we can actually see like the whole world aha Rophelia Maybe you can come at night and look at the stars. And we also need... What's this? We need to go in our inventory and equip that. Our inventory, what is it? Here. Well, it gives us some defense, so we'll put them on, I guess. All right, so we're looking for Gotta be somewhere up top, right? I mean, I guess it could be in to? here. What is this lock? My dear. Okay. Gotta be somewhere around here, right? Maybe I passed it? Seems like the most likely uh, solution here. 
They wouldn't have made it too far because we got to bring the moth back. It's got to be up top. We need to find the blackboard. Oh, it's right here. Oh my goodness. Protego. Lumos. How did I miss that? Whee! Lumos. What did I do? I did something. She even had the rest of the car. Hit G or F. I can't believe she's still on dance floor. Then why should I be? I don't know what I did there. <laughs> okay, anyway. We took our detour, let's go uh continue. Revelio. Revelio. I think they had peeves in the movie, right? Ah, we can really start getting some of these now. So I actually do want to run everywhere instead of the flu travel or whatever. There's stuff in here. Nope. Another adventure, are we? Professor Fig's classroom. Bathroom. What is with these things? It's like a monster chest. What what is the deal with that thing? Okay. Rebellion. So what does Fig teach? What is this? That guy did not like us from the very beginning. Yeah, he's not going to talk to us. Oh, we can.
We can weld potion. We'll be needing that at some point. Guess he doesn't want to talk to us. Let's just go on then. Ooh, can I open this? Level one lock. Okay, fine. Fine, if you want to be like that. My family loves them. Where's the stairs? Handy resource indeed. Your field. Revelio. Hey. Is this a person? Oh. I was like almost expecting it to turn to a person. I think we want to stay over here. No, I don't want to. Okay, let's look at our object. Let's figure out where we're going. Map. All right, then. I guess. Yes, we just follow this for a second. I wanted to find more of those books, like the pages flying around. Where were it seen so many of them earlier? Where, where were they all at? Rebellion. Seems like there would be something to do with that clock. But anyway, that's alright. Let's just keep on moving. But what survives the reign of this headmaster? I think we should have a moon calf in charge. Awful when they ask you a question now, isn't it? Oh wait, where is it telling me to go? Through that door? Okay. The side quests are available. Is there anything else out here? Go into this main door here. Akio. There we go. Hey, we got eight out of eight. That's. Thought there was one more in this room. Everything's locked. Okay, fine. We'll find. We'll head up here. We'll go do your stuff. Maybe. Oh, your mind. Revelio.
I mean, it revealed what? That's a door? That no one knows how to open? Okay. Let's go see this. Let's go. Let's go get some more magic. Who's going to teach me a Vodra Kadavra? Isn't that what it is? The killing curse. What about the room, Professor? I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. Oh, we gotta go to Hogsmeade. Oh, uh, excuse, Deke. Ah, there you are. I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit during your brief detour near... What was it you said? Some ruins? I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me. Isn't there? Nothing more, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from a streamer. Regardless, mm -hmm. you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In all right, regard, all right. I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier, we've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. You've managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own oh, wand yeah. to be far superior. We need, a, we need an upgrade. I've never heard of a spellcraft before, Professor. What is it? A spellcraft is a recipe of sorts used when conjuring objects. I shall explain more about them when you begin working with transfiguration magic. Can you tell me more about the potions, Shop Professor? Jay Pippin's potions stocks a wide array. Professor Sharp asks that they have a couple of particular recipes. There's an Ollivander's in Hogsmeade. There is. Most people are familiar with the shop in Diagon. Mr. Ollivander is a jet. I would trust mm, no one okay. else to pair me. They explained with the it. Good job, team. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a club. Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've no... I'd like to go with Sebastian. Glad to hear it. Mr. Sallow is a capable young... He'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow. Theophilus Can? Harlow. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, no time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbee. Mm hmm. There he is. Ah, there you are. Wait, why is the chest icon everywhere? Rebellion. Fine, whatever. Nothing. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed I do. And an exceedingly useful one at that. The mending charm, Reparo. Fixes things right up. Makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Hmm. It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. It also as repairs gigantic I am not broken the only bridges. I'll be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well. But first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today. 
See them through and then report back to me. <laughs> we will have you casting uh, So he's got a few little time. side quests for me to do and then I'll start on the task right away. All right, let's just get it done with. Rebellion. Professor. They are good luck. Collect the flying page near the broken statue. This is the right area. I wonder where the flying page is. Uh huh. Accio. Got it. Collect another flying page, huh? A flying page must be around here. Brilliant. That's it. That's it, really. That's all you're gonna give me? I completed the assignment. Marvelous. You let us give the old mending job. Remember to be deliberate in your inner. Yes, sir. Remember, your wand is a conduit of your magic. Oh, come on. Repero. Dun, 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 dun. What can we do with it, though? So we can fix bridges, okay. That's it. Very good. I was if hoping we'd like be able to maybe like kill ourselves. Have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate and lashed out. What the heck? Oh. Oh my goodness, my fingers were off by one key. That was, I was like, why is it not working? Okay, so three. That was four. Being used to this keyboard. All right, all done. Repair Um, probably should look at my map, figure out where I'm going. What do we got for gear, Edward? Gold room spectacles. Anyway, let's go to the map. What do we got? Show me where to go. Maybe. Anyway. That's with the... Okay, here we go. So we can turn this. That's actually useful. Rat quest. All right, let's go. So, so far, I think this is a fun game. <laughs> Definitely interesting. Let's see. Well, What's up, I'll Sebastian? Hello, Sebastian. Ah, my new charge. 
I'm told you're in dire need of supplies, and I'm to accompany you into Hogsmeade for them. Is this your first foray into the village? It is. Yep. I haven't left the castle since I arrived. Which was yesterday, well, so that kind of makes sense. To be the very best of guides, then. Hogsmeade's a charming little place. Self-contained, too. We should be able to find you everything that you need. Shall we? Of course I haven't left because we arrived yesterday. I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to join you today. As am I. Thank you, by the way. A beginner's guide of course. You're the only one who's ever bested me in a duel. The way I see it, I'd be wise to keep an eye on you. Mm -hmm. Speaking of Weasley, she seems to have taken quite a shine to you. Has she? That's nice to hear. I'm still surprised that a professor would entrust me with anything, given my detention record. Spend a lot of time in detention, do you? Just Where's my broom? Well We're in Harry freaking Potter. Speaking of detention, this trip to Hogsmeade might have saved Revelio. <laughs> Glad I could be of service. Madam Scribner, the librarian, was on the hunt for me, as is often the case. Professor Weasley came to retrieve me, and I was able to convince old Scribner that I had somewhere to be. So how did you manage to get on the librarian's bad side? Well, I suspect it's a matter of... Yeah, probably sneaking opinions. into the restricted section, reading she all the I shouldn't be books that you shouldn't. Section. And I, on the other yep, hand, I'm exactly. inclined to disagree. Oh, just one moment. This is an excellent spot to gather lacewing flies. They're pretty to look at. And if you stew them long enough, they make a powerful potion ingredient. Lacewing flies? Okay, well, we got some. So, can we go like anywhere? I mean, surely there's a border, right? It's big from the forbidden forest. Look, what's going on? See for yourself. Quite a sight, isn't it? You certainly don't see that every day. Hippogriffs. He's already seen the hippogriffs. Absolutely. Already to the left is the Forbidden Forest. Out of bounds to all students. Oh, hence the name. Precisely. They think it's too dangerous. I think they need to have yep, more we want to go there. Abilities. Ah, you can see Hogsmeade just past those ruins up ahead. Have you had much of a chance to explore the castle? A little. It's positively enormous. It is that. I've been there five years and barely scratched the surface. I don't know what these are for, but I'm going to take them. Oh? Any you'd like to share with the class? Perhaps one day. I can't go around telling you all my secrets now, can I? You still haven't told me how you became so good at dueling. Oh, those Thestrals. You can only see them if you came close to dying. That's why I could see... I couldn't see them, and then I could see them after the dragon almost killed us. I've always thought Thestrals pulling a carriage a bit grim. Though I suppose most people don't actually see them at all. But you can see them. Unfortunately. But you've seen quite a bit yourself firsthand too. Most notably that dragon attack. Hopefully the rest of your year isn't as eventful. I have a feeling it's going to be very eventful. This is quite a journey. What's this? There's a bear claw. Tough skin. Alright, dude. Let's go. I'll come out here on my own. Mr. Moon. He's the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Hello, Mr. Moon. Have you met our new fifth year? Pleasure. Uh, 
You might want to turn back, Mr. Sallow. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? Oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. This what guy is me? drunk, right? Demi guys. Ugly and airy and terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. A Demi guys. I don't know what he's putting in his pumpkin juice, but he's obviously had too much of it. I've never Where are these seen stones over here. What are these? Moonstone? Quite the character. My sister Anne thinks he's lovely, but I'd say he could improve a bit as a caretaker. Oh, is your sister in Slytherin too? She is, or rather, she was. She's not well at the moment, but she'll be better soon and back at Hogwarts. Rebellion. Why is it clicked over there? One second. All right, Hogsmeade. We got a nice little village here. Honestly, this is cool. One could bottle the magic of this place. I don't know if it's the shops or the people, but there's just something about Hogsmeade. We all flock to it like moths to a flame. Okay, we can like move quicker. So how would you like to do this? Weasley told me you had a list of things to get, a wand and some other bits. Yes, Dittany seeds, some spell crafts and some potion recipes. Perfect. Can't wait to see what you do with a new wand. And a short list gives you plenty of time to poke around the village. I just have to pop into a shop to find something for my sister. Let's meet up in the town circle when you're finished. Alrighty. Remember, have fun. It's Hogsmeade. What we got here. Okay, so we got... We're here, we got... Rolls. Ooh, ooh. Ollivanders. Let's just hit Ollivanders real quick right away. Give me one of those wands. I'll be right with. Ah, it's you. Um, just a moment, please. Act like he knows me. Ah. Uh, Hello, sir. I'm looking for... For a new wand, yes. It's about time. Yes, uh, about time. Well, you're our new fifth-year student, are you not? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivander's, I'm sure. Finest wand makers in the world. It's a pleasure to meet you, truly. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect wand, shall we? Hmm, uh... No, 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 not you. Um, ah, yes, yes. Hmm. Powerful core, ten and a half inches. Hmm. You might do. Here, give this one a try. Well, go ahead, swish. Nope, hmm. that's not the one. Oh, uh, once more, Pretty on. cool. Really swish it. What a spell, man. Oh dear. Well, this isn't a good match at all, is it? <laughs> uh, um, we'll find you something, not to worry. Mm. No, not you. Uh, uh, hmm. Perhaps. Yes. A rare wood, 13 and 3 quarter inches, dragon heart string. Let's give this one a try. No way. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, that one just teleported away from us. Nope. 
Looks like it's back to the shelf for you. Uh, this is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. How perplexing. Uh, well, there are thousands of wands, and you've picked two, you? so... Perhaps you... Uh, ah, there you are. Yes, I think you might be the one. Here, take it. All right, what's so special about it? Finalize wand. Okay. Bring you a feather, cushy 10 inches. How intriguing. Yeah, kind of like the darker wood, I think. Not that. Wood type 10 inches. Curious indeed. Thirteen and a quarter sounds good. You? How intriguing. Well, not. Unyielding. Rigid. Indeed. And one core options. So what is this what does this matter? A phoenix, a dragon, so unicorn is consistent magic. A great range of magic. Does this matter? Ah, I think I would pick Phoenix. Feather, phoenix. Exceptionally rare and a core with a strong sense of initiative. Okay. We'll just go with this. I don't know what this what really you think? affects. Extraordinary. <laughs> another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> now, how did that feel? Good. Different. I sensed a sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from it. So I think the I phoenix. To try it out. Of course. And a phoenix feather core is terribly selective. This will be an excellent match indeed. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised. Hope it doesn't like lock us out of certain to spells. Your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again if ever I can be of further assistance. All right. Ollivander's is done. What is next? Okay, let's look at our map. What do we got here? Oh my goodness. Finally. Most important of all things. We should be able to maybe change our eyebrow color finally. My mistake will be fixed. Please. Oh, please. Come in. Come. I'm sure I've no need to introduce. But I showed them. But look at you. Look. Looking for a change, are we? Yeah. Why not, I say? Some are going for that. But you won't find poisons here. No. Why don't you spend a moment choosing how you'd like... What services do you offer? Oh my goodness, it costs what money. You might be interested in? Okay, just one time. Okay. Oh, 
Okay. That's good. Eyebrows are fixed, guys. Look at that. It is beautiful. Revelio. Hmm, a chest here. Can I just let me take what's inside? Quidditch goggles. Okay. We'll run around and equip everything at one time. Uh, that's good for the rest of this. Okay, out we go and... Level 2 lock. Get over here. Oh my goodness, I'm so glad that we got that. Where are these talent points? There's a joke shop. Three broomsticks. Hogs made square. Deeply in stuns. Ooh, brooms. I think I oh we want that book page post office she apparently doesn't even want to say hi to us out we go. Can't imagine how models get by without the magic. Merchant. Hello. Rebellion. What do these things do? Why doesn't he want to talk to me? What What's going on? Let's go in the joke shop. We got to, right? Okay. nothing we can buy here I want to know why we can't buy anything in that one shop he has like a coin icon above his head it still won't let me the three broomsticks Icon, we got to go in and look, I guess. Oh, there's a chest. Let's go get it.
I'm getting all these random things. My person's going to look random when I'm leaving here. Blue solar protection goggles. What? Surely there's a purpose here. I'm not seeing, but... Can't get up. Okay, then, I guess, is there a cellar? There was a cellar. Secret entrance. Can't get me a good old butter beer. I see how it is. I see how it is. There's Ollivanders. But if Ollivanders is there. I don't think anyone at the ministry works a day in their life. Uh, that would be the other shop with the uh, brooms and stuff I saw. So anyway. I think then we can just kind of go find our stuff, it looks like. We'll go check out this one. And after that... An inquiring mind. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spellcrafts Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda's student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here. Thomas Brown. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson then? I'm afraid I have not sir. Ah, uh, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest. Creating something out of nothing. Of course it is not without complexity. But that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course. And you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. That's certainly something to aspire to, Mr. Brown. I look forward to that day. And I, too, see in it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. Hmm. For now, decoration. let's get the spellcrafts you need. A potting Seems table kinda... and a potion station. Yes? I believe so, sir. Good. Nothing like being able to grow your own ingredients and brew what you want, when you want. Let's have a look. Let's look at what we have, shall we? All right. If you're Make injured, potions. Feel free to take a look around at the rest of my infantry. Okay, guys. So at first, I misread that as breast feeder spellcraft, and I was confused. <laughs> Beast feeder makes much more sense. How much gold do I have? 176. Mm, so we're probably going to want like the potions ones for like making better health potions later. But anyway, why don't I see if I go here. Oh, the wand handles and where we got these. Headwear, we got... Ooh, it's blue. It says superb. Oh my goodness, guys. We are styling. Look at the feather. Oh my goodness. That is beautiful. And a scarf. Okay. We're starting to get like a look going for a guy. No. Ooh. 
flying mounts and that. Okay. Pretty cool. Look at us now. It hides my eyebrows. I didn't need to waste money on that. Rebellion. Um, I see lots of little dots. Okay. Yeah, we need a lot more money apparently. Rebellion. So what do we got around here that we could go get? There's a chest right here. Do I get in there? Here's one. I'm gonna have to do some just like running around trying to find. Rebellion. Okay, then where am I supposed to go? Do you like, is that bird or book page? Okay. Fidgets. Is it the magic neep? All right, let's just do our errands then. Pippin's potions. Welcome to J. Pippin's Potion Revelio. Okay, we gotta put that on. I think it's gonna match nicely. Oh, wait. Yeah. Great slot level? I don't know what any of that means, but. Okay. Now we're looking pretty sweet. Pretty sweet, guys. Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though, I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, no. I've always said. A potion's really that versatile. They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses. And I unveil new ones okay. from time to time. But for so you now, sell potions. Blah, 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 blah. What can blah. I do for you today? I can make... Protection and Wigan Weld. Feel free to take Great. a look at the rest and then of we got inventory. Focus, Thunder oh, Brew. If you're in a rush today. What do we need for ingredients? What? What do we need for the Wigan Weld potion? Oh. We could probably buy one of these. Yeah. 
That's good. At least a little bit. So if I were to uh come in here how do I how do I do this whole potions thing is what I want to do What was it I hit to see like all of my magic? Outpost? None. Collections. Challenges. Whatever. I'm sure it will probably show me in a little bit how to make a potion. I think it was just up here was the magic need. Yeah. Well, hello there. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Ah, oh, the Dittany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you, then. Merlin's beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively reeling from it all. Not at all. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo. Not everyone I think anybody, to and this speaks for every single person, no matter how old, if they came to me as a 30-year-old said, hey, we're going to teach you magic, because you're a wizard, actually, I would be ecstatic, just like I think nearly ever per every person would be. If they came to you at 60, hey, we're going to teach you to be a wizard. I'd be like, hell yeah, let's go to Hogwarts and learn. Whatever. Let me guess. You're after something fresh. Do I got that. Fuck, sweetie. Uh, I don't think we're going to have enough money where we want to make too many of these. Focus potion, Dittany leaves. Ah, so if we get Dittany leaves. We'll buy one. Just in case, because I don't know how hard this game's going to get at some point, but there is a Revilio. Alright, so next up, meet Sebastian. Oh, we want that. Who do you think you are? Akio. Ah. And if I... Revelio. Not mistaken, there's a chest down there. We gotta try and get that, don't we? Let's see. Just a little cold dip in the water. Okay. Really one of these? What what is the deal with the with the like fierce looking monster? I mean I attack them and they don't even do anything. All right, let's go meet Sebastian. I officially have all of my supplies. Excellent. Did you get what you needed for your sister? I did. So I suppose the world is our oyster now. Let's see what else we can get up to. Uh oh. This thing looks tough. 
put our headphones on for this. We're gonna have to fight that eventually, aren't we? Oh, there's more? Control. Oh, I don't like control that one. What is this Z? What was that? A taste of his own medicine. Nicely done. Sorry, I'm trying to figure out. What is it G? Okay. Oh my goodness. Not doing so good here. Look out. That seems to do more damage. That is one mean oh X. Ancient magic. Ooh. Goodness. A second troll. Did you two take on a fully grown troll by yourselves? I yes. suppose so. It's all a bit of a blur, to be honest. Merlin's beard. Are you all right? We are. And we were glad to help. I'd say help is a bit of an understatement. Nerve like that? The makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed, perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, officer. Singer. Officer Singer. And thank you, again. Rebellion. Oh wait, repair I was three. I'll go and see what he wants. Oh now you wanna to talk to me, huh? No he doesn't. That guy just is kind of irking me a little bit. Repair her. One less thing to have is a to worry about. Fix everything up nice and neat. Repair. Oh, now I can speak to the shopkeeper, huh? After all that?
Mr. Hill was just singing your praises. Yeah, he wouldn't talk to me before. Hello, I don't believe we've met. Allow me to introduce myself, Augustus Hill, Clothia Extraordinary. Oh my goodness, is he just cosmetics? Because I don't care anything about cosmetics. And not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. I was happy. Frankly, you deserve an order of merit. I own glad rags, wizard wear, and among my inventory are some unique items. And as I suspect this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one. Thank you, Mr. Hill. It's the least I can. Uh, now, uh, let's try. Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. That's it. Really? Yeah. I'm not going to equip it. Yeah, we're not going to wear that, dude. What do we got here, though? I don't think buying any kind of item that this lower level is going to be worth it. I'd say we've earned a butterbeer or two, wouldn't you? Might help me forget that I was almost pulled. I'd say that I... Perfect. The three broomsticks... I sell even more battle-worthy items. Should you be inclined, you're most welcome to the wonderful shop at your... Assuming it isn't utter bedlam in there, you might even meet Serona, the owner. She's a good one to know. You said you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. Okay. Who is this child? What are you not telling me? All you need to know is that if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. <sighs> Let's go. Did they see us? I don't think so. What was that goblin doing with Victor Rookwood? Vanrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen mm -hmm. him somewhere. So he's going to be the enemy. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. Okay, so... It's a treat to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. Now, what can I... Oh, there's a face I haven't seen before. <laughs> it's my first time here. Welcome. Welcome. On me. Heard about the attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one. Single-handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Well done. Mm, technically, Thanks he helped this. me a little bit, My but pleasure. anyway. I will say, <laughs> trolls in Hogsmeade. That's never happened before. Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with are... <laughs> That's how I mean. Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? <laughs> Your clientele's not what it used to be, Serona. Not to worry, Victor. This guy, I don't like leave, him. The caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. My friend is enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. 
I said, my friend is busy. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Why is this guy, if everyone hates him, why is he even Come allowed this. in this little town? The three broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Because my ancient magic can forever. turn you into a frog. Yeah, how you like that? Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Trolls? Ranrock and Rookwood? What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. And on that note, I think we should head back to the castle. All right, where are we going, guy? I'm certainly glad Serona was there. I can see that. She didn't seem at all in... I think you'll need to tell me why Victor Rookwood has you in his sights. But we could... Professor Weasley's certain to hear about the troll attack. Don't want to risk another detention. Hogwarts map. Where's our common room? Which one's had our common room in it? Which one was where we in? I can't remember. We're not near the library. Oh, wait a second. It just says fast travel to your common room. They're not like giving me. Oh, we'll just click on them all and see what happens. Okay, great staircase. There we go. Let's see if we can figure out how to save. I'm assuming it auto saves actually. And I think that is a good place to leave off the first episode. I want to thank everyone so much for watching uh, first stream. So like I said, put in the comments afterwards or whatever, if there's any audio issues or something like that. And let me know what you thought. And I will see you guys in the next stream or next episode, wherever you watch. Thanks again.